front of you are two panelists. My name is George Otieno. And my name is Sirio Mutu. To my right is our moderator, Madam Keisha. And to my left is our timekeeper, Mr. Innocent. This is the High School Business Questions Extravaganza 2020. A national platform that promotes education in high school countrywide. Their general framework and instructions in this competition. The following are the general framework and instructions. One, 94 schools to participate in the competition. Two, each school to be represented by one student. Three, each county to be represented by two schools. Four, each school to answer 20 questions in each session out of the two sessions, which is 40 marks. Five, the top school, the top five schools in the competition to get an award at the end of the competition. The questions are objective questions and applications in business studies. The questions to cover from form 1 to form 4 work. Each participant shall have at most 15 seconds to answer one question. 20 questions in 5 minutes. The questions shall only be read twice. We have two questions for each participant. The first question contains three marks. The second question contains four marks. A maximum of five marks for each participant in this competition. Business study students, welcome into the competition. Participant one. To answer this question. Participant one, to move forward for this question. You have two minutes to answer in this session. The first question, indicate the principle of insurance described I repeat, indicate the principle of insurance described. Part A, providing all the material facts concerning the property being insured. <coughs> Again, Part B, whatever remains after compensation belongs to the insurer. <coughs> I repeat, whatever remains after compensation belongs to the insurer. Part C of question one, the insured is put into previous financial position before occurrence of the risk. I repeat, the insured is put into previous financial position before occurrence of the risk. We are moving to the second participant.
all participants, here are the questions. Question number one, indicate appropriately whether the following text of competition is generic or enterprise. Indicate appropriately whether the following types of competition is generic or enterprise. A coffee seller competing with a tea seller. Enterprise. Jumbo jets competing with Silverstone Air in airlifting passengers. Generic. Butter shoe manufacturing company competing with imported shoes. Butter shoe manufacturing company competing with imported shoes. Enterprise. Thank you. We are moving to participant three. Participant three. I request that you move to the front. The first question for you. Highlight the type of market structure in the following statements. Highlight the type of market structure in the following statements. Part A. Part A. In the Kenya telecommunication market, there are only three service providers. Safari, <coughs> Airtel, and Telcom. I shall repeat the question. Highlight the type of market structure in the following statements. We have part A. In the Kenya telecommunication market, there are only three service providers, Safaricom, Airtel, and Telcom. Pass. Part B. Part B. KPLC, that's Kenya Power and Lighting Company, being the only company in charge of supplying electricity in the whole country. I repeat, KPLC, that's the Kenya Power and Lighting Company, being the only company in charge of supplying electricity in the whole country. Part C of the question. Naivas, Uchumi, Taskis, Ketias, Chopis, Nakumat, Homat supermarkets, serving all Kenyans in provision of goods. I repeat, Naivas, Uchumi, Taskis, Ketias, Chopis, Nakumat, Homat supermarkets serving all Kenyans in provision of goods. Thank you for your time. We are moving to participant number four. Okay. Indicate whether the following statements will lead you to, the, to, to a rightward or leftward shift on the supply curve. Indicate whether the following statements will lead to a rightward or leftward shift on the supply curve. Kenyan government deciding to reduce corporate taxes through legislation. Kenyan government deciding to reduce corporate taxes through legislation. Pardon? Um, indicate whether the following statements will lead to a rightward or leftward shift on the supply curve. Underline rightward and leftward shift. Kenyan government deciding to reduce corporate taxes through legislation. Two media companies liquidating from the Kenyan market.
to media companies such as Citizen or ATV liquidating from the Kenyan market. Loans and grants to corporate companies by the Kenyan government and the World Bank. Loans and grants to corporations by the Kenyan government and the, and the, and the World Bank. Thank you. We are going to participant number five. Participant number five. Your question starts now. Question number one. Identify the document used in home trade as described. I repeat. Identify the document used in home trade as described. Part A. It is an instruction by an account holder to his or her bank to pay the named person on the order a specified amount at regular intervals until the order is terminated. I'll, I'll repeat. An instruction by an account holder to his or her bank to pay the named person on the order a specified amount at regular intervals until the order is terminated. Part B. A demand for payment of goods supplied. I repeat. A demand of payment for payment of goods supplied. Part C, sent, it is a document sent to inform the buyer that goods ordered have been dispatched. It is a document sent by a seller to the buyer to inform him that the goods ordered have been dispatched. Your time is over. Participant six. Are you ready? Are you sure? Don't be. <laughs> yeah. uh, we start. Indicate whether the following descriptions relate to luxury comfort or necessity. Luxury or necessity. Indicate the following descriptions relate to luxury or necessity. The first one, living in a 40 bedroom house. Seeking medical atten attention from a doctor. Pardon? <coughs> audible, please. Come up again. Pardon. Taking dinner. Thank you. Just a single instruction. I request the participant to be audible, please. I request you to be audible. We are moving back to participant one. The second and last question for participant one. Question number two. Butter Company wishes to open its branch in Kisi Town. Butter Company wishes to open its branch in Kisi Town. Give two factors beyond their control that may affect them during its operation. 
Butter company which is to open its branch in Kisilan, give two factors beyond their control that may affect them during its operation. That's your point number one. Point number two. Government imposing high taxes 
on business funds. Government imposing high taxes on business funds. Thank you. Highlight two characteristics of economic resources. Highlight two characteristics of economic resources. As per our code, moderator, Madam Keisha. So, um, we want to thank you for, for your cooperation. And uh, you actually have the link, like, uh, you guys can be women in power. I'm usually, um, I'm not a great but you know, when you're like me, I'm very women, as you can see, the women who So, it's nice to have other women doing stuff that women can do, or it's hard for them to do at least. So, I'm impressed by the way. So, the first, in the first part, which was the first participant, she got five months for her things. <laughs> then, part two, he got three months. Out of five, all of them are out of five. So for this part three, she got five marks again. Participant four, she got three marks. And participant six, she got five marks. So in our first session, these are the rankings. At position one, we have participant one. At position two, we have participant three. The audience would love to see them. At position one, we have participant one. I request that she stands. At position one is participant one. There is a tie. There is a tie. Position one. We have participant one, participant three, and participant six. All of them to write. At position one, there is a tie. Participant yes. one, participant, participant three, and participant mm -hmm. number six. Those are first questions. The first time we ask the questions. Yes. So they, they go to all of them. Position two, again, there is a tie. <coughs> we have participant two. That the previous participants, one, three, and six, to have the seat. There is a tie at position number two, participant two, participant number four, and participant number five. Our first session of the show is over. We thank you and let's meet in our next session. Thank you.